Alright, well, this is an interesting video, because I have to review a battery bank. How do I do that? Alright, but all seriousness aside, this is my review on the Asus Zen Power Power Pack that came with my Zen Phone 2. I'm surprised that they didn't misspell power. But, all honesty, there's quite a few discrepancies that I want to point out. Now, all my videos, pretty much, I'm buying the stuff. I've never gotten a product sent to me but once, and that review never got onto the market because the product was so shitty that I didn't want to plague you guys with its existence. Um, but the Zen Power I got for free because it was within the BNH. Um, pack that I bought with my Zen phone, as I said. So, wh what do you say about a power pack? I mean, it has um, 10,050 milliamp hours, um, it has charge LEDs, um, and it charges using USB 2.0 for the stuff. It only has one port which is very disappointing, so I guess there's something, but the fact is that it says that it will output 2.4 amps, which is not correct. It only charges my phone at 1 amp, so where's the other amp? On top of that, This is the cable that's included in the box. What do you want me to do with this, Asus? Stick it on my ass? This is so tiny that it, frankly, this is unacceptable. So for 20 to 30 bucks, because it depends on when you on when and where you buy it. I expect at least a two meter cable. This is barely a meter. Barely. And in all honesty, it's not a meter because you have the connector that goes into each into each of the devices. So it's less than a meter. And I expect at least a two meter long cable for 20 bucks. Again, I got it for free, which I'm not complaining about. I'm not complaining to b and I'm not saying, oh, well, their service suck. No, like, that's fine. That's fine. And speaking of that, subscribe if you want to see the Zenfone 2 review, which is coming very soon. But the fact is, the Zen Power for the Zen Phone 2 should at least have a 2 meter long cable, have more than one charge port. I expect at least two or three charge ports. Even my My Charge cheap, uh, I think it's like a. Uh, yeah, it's like a 1400 milliamp hour battery pack, has two. It has one that is built in, and then one that you can plug in. It does also have the LEDs on it, but the fact is that this is less of a battery pack then that is, but it cost me more. 
So, I don't really understand how you can put in only one charger. Say that it will get you 2.4 amps when it doesn't. I mean, my Zenfone picks up on Asus True Power, which delivers more than 2 volts. Or 2 amps. Yeah, more than 2 amps. And what, what's weird is that the input is marked at 2 amps, but the output is marked at 2.4 amps. So how does that work? Like, does, I really want to know the ASUS engineering behind this, so if anyone can tell me, tell me down below. But, I mean, it's a battery pack. Like, how can, how can you review a battery pack? Honestly, I've been thinking to just put this review with my Zenfone review. But, I mean, I have it. So, why not? Why not do a separate review of it? To tell you that, sure, it's 20 bucks. It may come with your Zenfone if you buy it from B&H. But, it's probably not worth your money. Like, that's kind of the end, the end story here. Save up your money, get a better uh, charger, and that's going to be probably your best bet. Because if you get a better charger, you'll be able to charge more devices get maybe a bigger wattage. You never know. But there are a lot of options out there. Um, but the fact is... The fact that it was free, I'm not complaining. But the fact is that Asus will charge you 20 bucks for this is unacceptable. And again, as I pointed out in my monitor unboxing, sorry, monitor review that I will put up here. They want to achieve perfection, but they aren't. So where's the perfection, Asus? When will we get it? So, I want to thank everyone for sitting through this. If you liked it, give it a big old thumbs up, but if you didn't, give it a thumbs down and tell me why below in the comments. Also, in the description, there are ways to support me by not buying a cool t-shirt because my girlfriend hasn't gotten back to me with the uh, logo text. I gotta get on her about that. Not like that. Um, but there's also a PayPal donation link and anything you can throw my way is greatly appreciated. Um, I will start doing donation tiers, um, where if you donate a certain amount of money, I will feature you on the channel at the end of the video, um, or at the beginning of the video so that people actually see the donation that you did. So, that's probably a better option, because no one really sits through my videos. But if you did, thank you. And you are awesome, but also... Don't forget to stay subscribed because I release content every week, usually three videos a week. So, Monday, Thursday, and Friday. And sometimes on Saturday, if I'm feeling spunky. But, yeah. So, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe again. I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye! Yeah.